Hello, hello, hello. Everything Pisces. Welcome, 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 babies. If you're new here, welcome back. If you are returning, come on in, like, subscribe, comment, share. Thank you guys in advance. You already know what it is, my love. Kick your feet up. Get your shit, get your shit, get your shit, and get comfortable, because we about to make it do what it do loves. This is Pisces All Placements, Cross Watchers Non-Pisces, you are more than free to stay and watch, take what resonates, leave what doesn't, you do not have to be a Pisces or dealing with a Pisces to get a message here, guys, okay? Don't get caught up in the zodiac sign. Shuffles. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day, night, afternoon, whenever you see this. And it finds you in the grapes and highest of spirits, my love. Okay, so what's going on for my fishy baby? Three cards is what I heard. One, two, one more, three. Okay, baby. So let's see what we're talking about. Huh? I was just talking about somebody blackmailing somebody to stay earlier today. Look, here we go. Okay. So, Pisces, be careful. There's somebody around you that's all in your pockets. This is someone who um, is two-faced. They could actually be dealing with some type of mental issues. This person may be bipolar or they could just have narcissistic behaviors. This is somebody that plays victim all the time. Always wants something, always needs something. It's always everybody else's fault. Ain't never they fault. The reason why their life is falling apart. Always need somebody to help them out. That type of energy. Can't never do nothing for themselves. Um, and then if you help them out or do something for them, they fuck it off or mess it up. You know what I'm saying? It don't never work out and it's always somebody else's fault. That's the type of energy that I'm getting from this. It does say mediator here. It's somebody that's coming in with an ulterior motive. Or they have some type of hidden agenda. Either personally or professionally. So if somebody's going to come towards you, um, that's all in your pockets, right? Uh, they want something from you. The bottom of the deck does say blackmail to stay. But I do have I don't trust you. So this is somebody that you don't trust. And whatever they were doing... Somebody could have did something in the dark and it's finally coming to the light. So whatever is done in the dark is coming to the light. This could be this person coming in with these ulterior motives. You could have known this person just wanted something. Um, with this blackmail to stay, this person could have been trying to hold some type of information over your head. Um, something from the I keep hearing something from the past. Something that doesn't even matter now. Um, something that that no longer is an issue they can be trying to use. Um, but whoever this is. Talking shit about you. Okay. Somebody's talking shit about you. So this is somebody you've known for a while. Somebody's talking shit about you about um, things that you did in your past, though. Um, and this could be years ago. Like, you know what I'm saying? You may not even be in that same energy. You may not be that same person anymore. But all this person can come up with at this time is things from your past to talk shit about. But they're talking shit because you no longer trust this person. Something that they did in the dark came to light. And you stop fucking with this person. This could have been somebody, like I said, you were giving money to. You were looking out for them. You were helping them in some type of way. Yeah, you started loving you first and fuck all them haters. You started, yeah, you pulled your energy back from this person. You started loving on yourself because you found out that this person was smiling in your face and talking shit about you behind your back. You found out this person only was coming around to get what they could get out of you. And was, was never pouring back into you. Whether this is time, money, energy, sex. Whatever the case may be. So this person may be trying to pop back into your energy here. Let's say pull this one too. Okay. So let's see. This person's upset because apparently you're doing pretty good for yourself. Um... You're able to take care of yourself, okay? I don't feel like you're asking anybody for anything. You're not wanting for anything at this time. 
and they need you and you're not fucking with them. But this is somebody like I feel like in the past, they were able to come to you. They were able to get your help. They were able to give you some type of sob story. And, you know, because you're kind-hearted, Pisces, you get you gave to this person. You looked out for this person. But at, at some point in this connection, once again, you started loving you first. You said, fuck them. All the haters, friends, family, it didn't matter. If they didn't have your best interest at heart, if they were not pouring into you like you poured into them in the past, you stopped fucking with them. And this person is upset. But they're going to try, yeah, they're going to reach out to you. Hey, bitch, you're going to get some type of phone call. I'm telling you. This person is going to call you with some type of sob story. Because they feel like you got it and you should give it to them because you got it. But you got it because you work for it. This person don't want to work for shit. Clarify they all in your pockets. Pisces energy. Told you the devil. I can't make this shit up. The devil. And I feel like this is someone you possibly know since childhood. This could be a relative, a sister, or a brother. Um, but this is somebody that was trying to keep you bound and stuck to them. This is somebody that was low vibrational. This person, um, if it's a man, they may have a, a goat teeth and a low, a low shaven beard. A low haircut, they may wear hats. Clarify they all in your pockets. Yeah, to a source. Because you blocked them. I am zen, so fuck off. You cut this person off, you block this person, and they're upset. But this is, like I said, this is somebody that was smiling in your face, pretending to be your friend, pretending like they fuck with you. Um, you know, and, and... <laughs> They were using you. This could be a lover that you, um, an ex-lover that you were into. This could also be someone that you just have love for. A friend, a family member, somebody that you cared about, so you used to look out for them. Clarify these mental issues. Yeah. And these motherfuckers have the nerve to do some magic on you. The magician in reverse. It didn't work. It didn't work. The church say magic. Whatever magic they did on you, it was reversed and sent back to sender. This is why they're having mental issues. So somebody, somebody here, this devil, low vibrational motherfucker, got mad because you stopped giving to them. You blocked them to a source. You started focusing on you. Loving yourself first. Fuck them all the haters. So they sent this magic towards you. The magic did not work. It was reversed and sent back to sender. This is why this person is having mental issues. And, and then they're trying to blame you. Plays the victim all the time. They're just narcissistic ass motherfucker. Got mad because you cut them off. They sent magic towards you. And because the magic was returned to sender. And now they're dealing with the, the offset of their own bullshit. They're trying to blame it on you. Now it's your fault. They playing victim still. That's why mental issues. Yeah. Now this person all in their motherfucking feelings. Could be dealing with a um, Pisces Cancer or a Scorpio. King of Cups. This is somebody that's all in their emotions. All in their feelings. They shit is all fucked up now. Yeah. Because they getting tower moments. The same tower moments they tried to send to you. The same tower moments they tried to send to you were reversed. And they watched it come back. Facebook, Instagram, they watching. The same tower moment they tried to send to you was reversed and sent back. Yeah. This is your ex, King of Swords. Ex-friend, ex-lover, ex-family member. And I feel like you spoke your truth to this person. Yeah. This could be an ex-lover for sure. Nine of Pentacles, you got single, you stable, you out here looking good. You are not giving to these people. And they, they had an ulterior motive here. Clarify mediator. Yeah, six of swords. They didn't want you to go. They did not want you to look, they're gonna tower back there. They did not want you to go. You see him packing the shit and getting ghosts? This could be somebody, like I said, a family situation. Someone you got a family with, it's a whole family here. But they tried to blow shit up for you because you was getting up out of there. Six of swords, moving away from your emotional conflict and moving towards peace. This person did not want you to have peace. I am zen, so fuck off. They did not want you to have peace. You walked away, found your peace, started focusing on your money, started focusing on you, loving yourself first. They were unable to stop you. It was reversed. This one here. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles. I told you. 
You out here getting that paper. You looking good, you smelling good, you shining, you secure, you stable. And they did not want you to have that. They did not want you to run and turn into this queen of pentacles, men or woman, Pisces. Yeah. See, they're trying to come back. Knight of Cups. I I'm back, bitches. I'm telling you, this person finna try. That's Spirit said this is a warning. This person finna try to pop back up into your life. Okay? This person trying to come back to hold on to you. They're coming back to destroy your peace. They already sent magic toward you and it was returned to center. It didn't work. So now they're going to try to come back in like a family member, like a friend, trying to make amends because the magic didn't work. Because now they're dealing with mental issues and, and, and they can't eat, they can't sleep, they got anxiety because the magic was returned to cinder. No, you know this person's a gaslighter. You know this person's full of shit. What's that? Uh, two of cups. Yeah, this person gonna come back and pretend like they're the king of pentacles and wanting this two of cups energy. Don't you fall for it. Taurus Virgo Capricorn energy. Yeah. Could be a Virgo. Hermit energy here. You've been in hermit mode from this person. Spirit is saying stay in hermit mode away from this person. Keep your distance because they just coming in to manipulate you. The moon. Pisces, they're just coming in to try to cause illusions and manipulate you. You've already healed from this for once. You already intuitively know, high preachers. You know the truth. Ace of Swords. This person just coming back for a reconciliation to fuck up your world. They want to destroy your world. And they want they want to come back because they see you out here shining. You a whole star. This person could be in jail, judgment. They could be in spiritual jail. But they're mad because you're blocking them and you're having this good life without them and they're stuck. They're stuck in this low vibrational energy wherever the hell they are. Yep. This person wanted you to give to them and nobody else. They're coming back because they want you to give your money, Queen of Pentacles, to them. Yeah, they're not trying to let you go for a pentacle. They're trying to hold on to you. They could also try to come back in and have sex with you. The spirit said you a badass. You good. You already know. Pisces, you already know what it is. I can't make it up. You the high priestess. You intuitive, you already know, and you're protected. This could be your warning here. Just know that there is a lover, an ex-lover, a past lover, an ex-friend, an um, ex-homeboy, ex-homegirl, Ex coworker, ex somebody that was that you used to help out, that you used to look out for, until one day you said enough was enough. And when you said enough was enough, you pulled your energy back, you blocked this person, they started sending magic towards you. Once it was returned to sender, it started affecting them mentally. And now they say, okay, the magic's not working. It's affecting me. Let me go see if I can go back in and gaslight my way back in, bullshit my way back in, allow this person to let me back in so I can get what I need. And once again, it could be time, energy. They want what you work for without having to do the work. And they want to leave you with nothing. Hmm. Bottom of the deck, that's the motherfucking truth. That's the truth. Yeah. This person finna come in and try to offer you some type of love to get back in. And it's all a game. It's all a game to get what you want. This person finna try to come in and gaslight you, babies. First off, because they think it's gonna stop the effects of the magic, which it's not. Okay? Um, nothing's gonna stop the effects of the magic because it, it, they sent it, it has, it has to take effect. But it just didn't take effect on you. It's going back to the sender. But it will take effect. Um, and secondly, because you intuitively know. Those well, spidey senses is going to ring. Like, no, that this person here. Yeah, you walked away. You stay away. Hey, the cups. <laughs> you walked away for a reason. I don't see you allowing this person back into your life. Whatever reason it was you walked away, you possibly could still be like, um, I forgave you, but I don't forget. You ain't forgot what these people did. Clarify they all in your pocket is devil. Clarify the devil. Yeah, this devil could be um 
a queen of cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, once again. So there could be a masculine energy all in their feelings. There could be a, a feminine energy all in your feelings. This devil, this could be you, Pisces. They're all in your all in your pocket. You just Pisces energy. Give me one more. Yeah, they want to reconcile with you, Pisces. Three of cups. This devil wants to come reconcile with you, honeys. They want to come disturb your peace. Clarify the two of swords. Yep, because you got victory and success here. They only want to come reconcile because you got victory and success. You could be on some type of platform. People could watch you. People could be giving you some type of recognition here. And that's why they want to come back towards you. You look too happy. You celebrate. Six of cups. I'm telling you. You out here doing your shit. Clarify uh, this mental illusions. Yeah, you walked away. This person is upset because you walked away from them. You saw through the illusions. That big old moon up there in the corner. You saw right through the illusions. Give me one more for this mental illness. Because you're the high priestess. Pisces energy. And you stood in your power. You put your guard up. Queen of Swords. You cut these people out and you made some changes. And they're mad because you walked away, you put your guard up, and you changed. You intuitively was guided to do this, though. To leave them out in the cold. And this person is mad that you left them out in the cold. And they finna try to be nice or, you know, um, apologize. Whatever it is, they, they, but it's, it's not sincere. They're coming back in because they just want what you got. Clarify this mediator. Yep. They're under judgment, though. They're under judgment for doing this bullshit. Ain't no getaway. Ain't no get back. Ain't no... They under judgment. Spiritual judgment. Yeah. For doing the fucking magic. Ain't no get back from that. Yep. They tried to affect your money. Ace of Pentacles landing right on top of their all in your pocket. They're under judgment for doing magic, trying to affect your money and your financial windfall here. Yep. And now they're trying to cause tower moments. Now they're receiving these same tower moments they sent to you. Like I said, now they deal with anxiety. They can't sleep. This mental illness here because they tried to betray you. They tried to betray you, stabbed you in your back several times. Hey, you persevered. You persevered. You sent that shit back. Well, go around, come right on back around. They thought they was going to knock you out. They thought you they was going to knock you down by doing this magic. And all they did was fuck themselves up. What they sent to you was returned right back to Cinder. And look at you. You hopped in your car and you moving on. You looking good. You're shining. You still moving forward. They didn't stop shit. Not a motherfucking thing. They tried to slow it up, but they ain't stop a motherfucking thing. And the chariot is moving quickly. Yeah. Knight of Wands. Things are in your favor. Good news is in your favor here. Spirit say that's the truth. Ace of Swords. Yeah, and now this third party, friend, family, ex, they heartbroken. They heartbroken because... God is dealing with their asses right now. The hair fine. They're under judgment from God for doing this magic against you, for trying to cause these tower moments. And you get a patch in the new beginning. Ace of Wands. You get a patch in the new beginning. I told you this person finna try to come back. Could be a Virgo. The Hermit again. And try to apologize. Page of, cup, page of Cups. Don't fall for the okie dog. Spirit say, I can't make it up. Don't fall for the okie doke. God says stay defensive. That's the hair fun in the seven of wands. This person just coming in to manipulate you. Because you single, you stable, and you doing good. You got a lot of other choices and options. Don't fall for this. Okay? This person just want to slow it up. They want to turn the luck that you got into their favor. They're hoping for good news here. They want your ten of pentacles, babies. You've already hopped in the boat and got ghosts. Stay ghosts. This person going to come in towards you and tell you they want to be a team player. But only because you're in this queen of pentacles energy. You've already closed out this cycle. Leave that person right where they are. They a fake ass emperor or a fake ass empress. They need to go sit their asses down somewhere and heal. Because their asses is going to fuck around and lose their life. 
with the death card. Playing with you. They already carrying a lot of burdens for putting this work on you. And you still got a happy home emotional fulfillment. And they fucked up because they get to watch it. You were protected by Archangel Michael and God. Archangel Michael and God. God love you, baby. And can't nobody or nothing come up against you. They mad because you speak your truth. And they stuck. You standing in your shit and they stuck. And they in competition with you because you are the true empress. Man or woman. So yeah, they coming in here to gaslight you, babies. This phony fake ass proposal or offer. Be be careful. They just want to cause delays and hold you up. Don't 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 fall for the okie doke honeys. Open up little boxy. Yeah. Keep loving you first, okay? Pisces, keep loving you first. And fuck them. All the haters. Yeah. They gonna do whatever they can or say whatever they can to keep you to stay. They don't want you to go. They know you don't trust them. And don't trust them. Because everything they did in the dark has come to light. And if it has not come to light yet, it will. You will find out about the magic. You're gonna find out about all the shit they did to you behind your back. If you haven't already. So who is this that Pisces needs to be aware of? You know already Virgo, because the Hermit and popped out several times. We got Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio here. Um, we had the Pinnacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy here. Look like everybody here. Wands is here. Everybody's here, so it could be anybody. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Everybody here. We got actual Pisces here with the High Priestess. We have the Amen. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Queen of Swords. Everybody's here. Cancer energy. Oh, that was fire just happened to pop out. Let me give a little more shelf. This is fire popped out. Earth was just at the bottom of the deck. So let's see. Who is this that's all in Pisces pockets? Capricorn. That's that devil. Leo. Who else is this all in Pisces pockets? Aries. Who else is all in Pisces pockets? Aquarius. Who's all in Pisces pockets? Who's all in Pisces pockets? We got Gemini. We got the fire, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Who's all in Pisces pockets? They go to Virgo. I don't lie, Virgo. Who's all in Pisces pockets? Libra. Bottom of the deck, air, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, on the cut, there go Cancer. So we have Cancer, Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Capricorn, Gemini, um, Virgo, Libra, air, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, um, which is all here anyway. Fire, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. So if this resonates with you guys, let me know. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Until next time, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Bye, my fishy babies.